Okay, we're gonna add stop leak to a sealed system in a KitchenAid refrigerator. And um, the way this works is you hook your can up to the, to the service valve, just like this, okay? And after you have your Refreon up to par, what you wanna do is have your can set ready to go, but you wanna shut your refrigerator off. The way it works is the refrigerator has a high side and a low side, all right? And they're gonna equalize when you turn the refrigerator off. That will build pressure in the low side, and that's the pressure that we're gonna to use to pressurize this can. After shutting it off and letting it sit for about five to 10 minutes, the pressure should go up to about 70, about 50 to 70 PSI, and that's plenty enough to pressurize the can. Then, after you start it back up, after it runs for about 10 to 15 seconds, the low side will go down to about 10 PSI, and then you will inject the can's contents into the system and it should inject nice and quickly. But you wanna throttle it in very slowly so you can put your ear to the bottom of the can so that you can hear it or just be very, very careful and monitor it by your amperage on your compressor. If you see the line frost up or anything, that's definitely a sign you're moving too quickly and just move it in real slow and you should be okay and hopefully that'll solve your leak problem.